hey there, and tonight it's me again. So, uh, I'm, I'm having a, a brain thing at the moment. So, here's my question to you, and be sure to leave that in the comments, uh, even before the video starts. My question to you is, at what point does, at what point does something become a lie? So, let me give you an example. So, your mom, girlfriend, aunt, you're just whatever, uh, asks you if, um, if you're going to, um, come to Christmas dinner. And you say, Yes, I'm going to come to Christmas dinner. Let's say they're asking this in June. And you, you know, maybe maybe they ask a couple more times. They ask in July and then August. You don't hear the question again. Now, obviously, Christmas is a long way away from August. And something comes up. And you're not able to make Christmas dinner because the, um, you know, uh, you know, everything, uh, you know, everything, you know, happens and you're just like, I just, I just can't make Christmas dinner. At what point is it a lie? Because obviously something changed in that time. For me, it's only a lie if you if you knowingly said I'm going to come to Christmas dinner and you knowingly had plans to not. Or is it is it that you didn't update someone? Is that the point at which it becomes a lie? So, for instance, some, you know, you know, things come up and you know, you know, fully farewell that you're expected at Christmas dinner, but you don't update anybody and Christmas dinner comes and they're expecting you and you don't show up. Have you lied to that person? Maybe. Okay, I got another one. <clears throat> Maybe it becomes a lie when... So, okay. Maybe it becomes a lie simply because you said an untruth, period. So, you, someone says, are you coming to dinner? And rather than saying, yes, I plan to, you, you, know, you say, yes, I will be there. Maybe that's a lie. I spend a good portion of, like, all of my day, and anyone who knows me in real life will tell you this, I play devil's advocate on just about everything, you know. But, yeah. I am very curious when you think that that becomes a lie. Um, and this actually, this, this holds some significance to me personally, not because of Christmas dinner, but, um, one of my previous employers, um, did this on several occasions. So, um, as an example, um, I had a, an employer where, um, you, in order to get in the door to the employer, you had to use a little key fobby thing, kind of like this. Okay, and it's like an RFID thing, so, you know, boop, it gets you in the door. Now, that employer, um, early on in the process of setting all that up, said something to the effect of, you know, we could use this to clock people in and out. 
somebody among us, don't remember who, doesn't matter, said, uh, so are you gonna do that? Oh, no, 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 that's, no, we don't know, we're not gonna do that, no, no, no. And then it came up a while, a while after that, for a certain subset of the, um, of the staff, um, to sort of keep an eye on that particular, you know, subset. And it was like, oh no, but it, it doesn't, it doesn't affect you. No, not at all. No, 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 no. And then sometime later, it was strongly implied, if not outright said, don't remember at the moment, but strongly implied that everyone should be waving their particular fob to, to get in as a backup or, or some such for the existing timekeeping. Now, I mean, there are a lot of problems with that, but for example, you know, I come in at 6, 7 a.m., whatever, you know, I'm gonna, you know, put my finger in, Three, four, five people follow me in the door. It creates a traffic problem when everybody has to sit there and do their little key fob, key fob, key fob. Because those key fobs don't always work. At least the ones we had were. Didn't. <clears throat> and uh, I, in particular, my key fob notoriously rarely, if ever, worked. And then later on, it, it did become an issue where um, it's like, oh, well, it says here that you uh, you entered the building, but you never exited. Or, you know, it says here you uh, left the building for, like, five hours. Why? Well, yeah, you know my key fob doesn't work. You know, I don't always have my key fob or whatever, whatever. So... I guess my point is that I'm not going to hide this. I'm a little bit salty because I truly feel like I was lied to. But I don't know when I was lied to. I don't know if I was lied to in the beginning, the middle, or the end. You know, I, I, genuinely speaking, the people who I work for, I like to be able to, you know, set in stone, unless, you know, actual, you know, external factors come into play, which are understandable. I like to be able to take people at their word. So when was I lied to? I don't know. <laughs> um... You know, and, and that particular workplace, there were, there were a lot of similar situations where it was like, oh no, don't worry about X. A couple months later. You know, X is a thing, but it's not really a big deal. You did X? Like, this is the progression. I'm like, oh. Whatever, man. So, let me know in the comment section down below when you think I... Uh, when, when you think that something becomes a lie, um, because yeah, I mean, it, 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 sort of looking back, it was always the plan to do it. It was always the plan to do it. It was just a matter of easing into it. Like, yeah, you know, there are a lot of examples of that that I can't really share, but I I can definitely tell you that it was not a case of, you know, oh no, that'll never happen, and and then that being true at that time, and then external factors. It was just a matter of like, oh, don't worry about it. A couple months later. Worry a little bit about it, but not a whole lot. A couple months later, you should totally be worried about this. Anyway, 
Uh, yeah. Uh, if you have a similar uh, situation, similar story, similar uh, anything, let me know in the comment section down below. And uh, till next time, don't forget to like, subscribe, and do all those things that make me love my job. Also, be awesome to yourself and amazing to each other. Okay, I'm going to shut the camera off now. I'm going to shut it off. You should probably click one of these links, like these or these. If there are links, maybe I didn't even put links on the screen. I've been bad about that. All right. You should do a thing. 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 And boom!